Carlos. Long time no see. Sure. Not long enough to forget me, huh? I've got to get back to work. No, no, I think you have time to learn a little bit. Respect. Hey, whoa, back off. I stayed out of your and Paula's business while you two were together. You got no business coming in here messing with me about your ex-girlfriend. Sounds like you need to calm down. We just need some information. What do you want to know? Well, two things. First, we need to know where she is. She looks You should write it down. Second thing, do you have any smokes? See ya, Carlos. Better get your boom bat out of here, Sam. Mom and Dad are going to be home soon. When? How should I know, Nimrod? I got Jack. I don't understand half the things she says in the Paul, it's time to get up. I don't wanna. You've got to work. I don't gotta. No more working for loud assholes for this girl. Yeah, you do gotta. Besides, it's not even that bad. I'm fine. Anyways, you've gotta get out of here before everyone gets back. <gasps> Sorry, kiddo. Thanks for letting me stay here, Sam. I really appreciate it. Yeah. You've been pretty vague as to why you had to come here in the first place. Uh, it's a long story. It's about two things, really. One, that she took it. And two, that she took it from me, without asking. And then she took off. It's some real below-the-belt bullshit, you know? Like, she stuck her punch, man. It's goddamn disrespectful. What is this, the end of, like, private property? The rise of communism in the U.S.? So, we're going to go get it back. Think of us as, uh, crusaders for justice. Freedom fighters. Real American G.I. Joes. So you're ready, right? We're just gonna walk in there, get my box, and get out. No sweat. I th have you ever broken and entered before? I saw this thing on TV. They use a pair of pliers and pry open the lock with a screwdriver. It's kind of messy, but... <sighs> Man, do you think I should talk to her or something? I mean, like, to teach her a lesson, of course. I don't know. I don't... don't give me any more snickerdoodle bullshit about Russians and the CIA. Why are you here? Remember my ex-boyfriend, Harry Fontaine? Yeah? Is he giving you trouble? Do you want I should say something to him? No, no. It's more like I'm giving him trouble. You see, when I left, I took something of his. It's stupid. Well, you're safe here. You won't even let your parents know I'm here. How is that safe? Paula, you know what they're like. If they knew I had a girl in here, I'd be in all kinds of trouble, and I just don't need that right now. Sam, grow a pair. You're 18. You're an adult. Paula, work. You gotta go. Fine. You got up for a shower? Make it fast. back.
You gotta have hidden it around here somewhere. Thanks, comrade. Something new, breathing life into the lifeless without a breath of air.